joining us. I'm Craig Day. The grant will focus on building a corridor that consists of the latest in technology and advanced mobility. News on 6's Jordan Tidwell is live with the details. Jordan. Craig, Mayor G.T. Bynum says this is a historic day for Tulsa and should bring in more than $3 billion to the city. Mayor G.T. Bynum and members of Tulsa's Build Back Better Coalition watched today as President Joe Biden announced a $38.2 million grant is headed to Tulsa. This is about investing in them, believing in them, helping them transition to a new world. We believe in Tulsa that there is a tremendous opportunity out there to create extraordinary wealth in the 21st century when it comes to mobility. The money will be used to create the Tulsa Regional Advanced Mobility Corridor. There's four proposed projects. The first creates a drone corridor from Tulsa to Stillwater for drone testing. Also a research center in the Greenwood District focusing on developing new technology and funding for more degree programs and apprenticeships to meet the needs of the growing industry. And then building a new industrial treatment facility at the Tulsa Port of Inola. Yeah, we want Tulsa and Oklahoma in general to be the center of the advanced air mobility universe uh, for the entire world. Members of the coalition say these four projects should create up to 40,000 jobs in Tulsa and help green country be successful in the future. Nobody's getting left behind, and Tulsa and our coalition is committed to making sure Tulsa is ready for the future. Our industries, our jobs, our talent, that everybody is ready for the future. Oklahoma is one of two states in the country who had two grants approved, with Oklahoma City getting funding as well. Jordan Tidwell, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.